Hi everybody, my name is Elif. I'm eight, just like you, and sometimes when I'm bored, I imagine I'm small as a mouse. I'm maybe new, but I love to play, and I hope we can be friends. The girl next to me proposed to play with her in the sandbox. I made a friend today. Her name is Aster. Looks like Crocus' favorite tricks! I should gather as much as possible! Hop, hop. Let's go find Crocus! If I remember, he should be near! special book from the library. Will you help me find it? All right. First, The Fable of the Donkey and the Dog by Jean de La Fontaine. See, Crackers, because the donkey didn't want to have the dog, he got eaten by the wolf. That's why mutual help is so important. Don't worry, I'll never let you get eaten, silly. You're my favorite reading companion! Alright! It's open! Hey! Look, Crocus! We must figure out the door's combination! Can you help me? There is Miss Martin's desk! I just need your help getting up there, and I'll remember where the book was. Crocus! 
Marcus, watch out! Oops. You said playing is for outside and napping is for inside. Sorry. Does he really have to sleep in his doghouse tonight? It's cold outside. Oh, sorry, Crocus. to visit those memories again. I'll be right back. You're the best boy. It's open. You can enter, Crocus. I should go here. Hop. The library is huge! I imagine I'd be like a little mouse running around in books. Crocus? Don't worry. The storm is only outside. You're safe inside. Ah! Never mind. It's inside too. Move over, Crocus. Under the bed is not big enough for the two of us. Crocus, I need your help pushing this book tower. Wow, Dream Hunter. That was my favorite book. Should work now. <laughs> Just like in the fable, Crocus, we need to help each other. The train in direction of Bedroom Town is blocked due to a giant dog on the tracks! <laughs> the dog is destroying the whole track! Who could save us? Don't fear! He lives here! I'll fix the track and calm the beast for you, beautiful citizens! <laughs> A 
Fluffy. He runs around with his filthy ears in the wind. <laughs> I like to imagine him like the toy I used to have. It was um, a little dog on wheels. <laughs> I should go here. Come here. Uh, this looks like a puzzle. Some pieces don't match the model. I should go here. Hey, you! Leave my dog alone! Bad dog! Crocus, stay behind me! Shoo, bad dog! Are you okay, boy? Did this chihuahua hurt you? That's it, Crocus. Luna and her aquatic friends. I just need to get down and meet him on top of the Tower of the Thousand Pillows. Follow me, boy. All right, Crackies. We are in the reading corner. Or what Ren and I like to call the pillow tower. Look, there is Ren just waiting for me at the top. All right, let's go. I'll help you cross and I'll join you later. I just need you to stay there for now. So, you like to imagine things too? Others used to say I was weird. Living in a sun castle sounds awesome. We could be queens of this sun kingdom. Aster, queen of sunland. And Ellie, the night queen, going on adventures and bringing back treasures. See what I can do. Of elephant crockets. That could be a movie. <laughs> 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 
What do you think? We're welcoming. about our shooting range. Let's see if I still got it. Yes! That's Crocus' baby picture. I never forget the day we got him. I took you as a plushie for three months. A very fast and destructive plushie, yeah. but the best one ever. Huh, I just need to figure out Mr. Reeve's combination puzzle. On the other side. Shoot! You can't go on the tower, boy! I'm sorry, Betty. Can you be a good boy and stay on this pillow for me? You're the best! I'll go get Ren and I'll come right back for you! Phew! There 
nearly made it! Esther, who is Poppy? You didn't mention her before. Are you sure she's going to like me? She looks a bit scary. Poppy the dragon, protector of Sandland. Oh, see, the terrifying Poppy. <laughs> I hope Crocus is doing okay. I get him a big treat when I come back. I I don't want to show you. It's because it's bad and I don't want you to be mad. Are you sure? Thanks, Mom. I won't hide it from you again. I promise. to be the best fish expert the planet has ever seen. <laughs> hey, I can see Astrid and Poppy from here. Let's get to class before Miss Arida closes the door. I can't wait to present Crocus to you guys. You're going to love him. <laughs> <laughs> 